obviously I've got a trial version of uh, Home Designer Pro 2020 open. And I created a, a little balcony and a, and a staircase. I saw your post and I thought, well, gosh, he doesn't know how to use the software. <laughs> so I'm going to open the uh, stair dialog and see what we can do. You can see here, you got a, no balusters on the right side because I've got it shoved against the wall and then balusters out here. Well, you can control, let's see, let me look at your picture again. Yeah, here's your picture that you posted. And that's a, very easy to emulate. Maybe not in detail, but generally to emulate that. Like, okay, we'll start over here with materials. And I'm gonna go to, uh, we wanna go to rails, newels, balusters. And select those and change the color to uh, black, like your picture. <clears throat> oh, there we go. Okay, I got that part done. Now, looks like your balusters in your picture are uh, skinnier. So I'm gonna go over to Newells and Balusters and set the uh, balusters to a half inch thick. And then the top rail, let's see, let's go to railing. Oh. Home Designer Pro doesn't have the ability to change top and bottom rails. Okay, well, maybe you're happy on that. In Chief Architect Premier, this isn't a problem. But we're not, I'm not in Chief Architect Premier, which I use every day. Okay, what? let me see what, under railing, I can just turn it on, turn it off. I can't really alter the rails. at least in a stair, stair dialogue. Let's see, your new poles, they're a little bit fat. Let's see, yours are more like, uh, inch and a half. That's a little bit closer to your picture, except for the top rail, which in a, a stair you can't do. Let's take a look at the, Railing dialogue. We'll click on that. Click on this. <clears throat> and we do the same thing with it. I'm going to change that to uh, 1.5 and half. Oops. There we go. Go to materials, rail. New baluster. It should be a plan material now, color black, yeah. Okay, let's see what else we can do with the, if there are any choices for railings per se. About controlling the top, the top and bottom rails. I think that's over on rail style. I don't see rail style. There it is. I don't see much ways to customize the top rail or bottom rail. Let's see if I've missed it. Okay, here we go. Include bottom rail. And you can raise it or not. I think yours is slightly raised. We'll raise it a little bit. 
<clears throat> yeah, in, in Home Designer Pro, you can't easily, in the dialogue, just alter the top and bottom rails. You can have them there or not there. In Cheap Architect, you can put fancy rails on there. You can create your own profile and, and apply that to the, to the rail, but not in Home Designer Pro. We'll click OK. Oh, and I thought I had both walls. I'll tell you what. I'll just use the eyedropper. Get the black. And finish up in the dialogue. I'm going to rail style. Where's rail style? There it is. And include the bottom rail. Raised right off the floor. Half post. Oh, I missed a material setting. That's over here on uh, newels. Yeah, that should be black to emulate your picture. Color black. Oh, one other thing. I didn't change the, uh, we'll change that to half an inch to emulate like metal balusters and make this one point. You've got quite a, quite a few uh, controls, <clears throat> but they are limited. I'll give you that, uh, but they're not, uh, I mean, that's very much like your picture. Not perfectly like your picture, but quite similar, e except for the stare. Uh, but something you may have not already have looked at, you can also go over here to, um, let's, I'm going to click on this wall and hopefully I can get both this time. Okay, I'm going to go over to rail style and use panels this time. And uh, you change the panel type over on newels and balusters under uh, panels. The solid is what came up, but what else is there available? <clears throat> Let's see, not mill work. Yeah. <clears throat> so here's, here's metal cable, chain link fence, various decorator type panels. I've used this in a few times. It's kind of a nice effect. <clears throat> Again, I didn't get both walls, but that's all right. <clears throat> we'll go over to uh, rail style and uh, Well, let's see, I have to go to rail style and select panels, don't I? Yeah, there I go. <clears throat> Look at the rest of the panels. I stopped them at one because I, I have some affinity for it. Okay, there's docks. I've never used that, but uh, if you're ever going to do a boat dock, here's glass panels you could use. And of course, it's straight iron work. And there's a lot of choices. And, and these, of course, let's go back to glass. Let's go with that. Now, these can't be applied to stairs. That would be a nice uh, upgrade you know, even in cheap architect. But uh, if you'll explore, my point is, if you'll explore the dialogues and really look at what's there that you can choose, you can do a lot. You can't do everything, but you can do a lot. Anyway, I hope this helps you. Thanks for watching.